Hi, in this video we're going to learn about how to install Visual Studio 2013 Community Edition. So we're going to see right from downloading the software and installing the same. Let's get started. Step 1. I'm going to search for Visual Studio 2013 Community Edition in Google and let's see this. And then so normally you'll get two types of installers. One is web installer as well as op offline installer. So I'm going to search for offline installer because if you want to install multiple times in or if you want to uninstall and reinstall the software, it's always good to go for offline installer because you don't need to download the software again and again. You can use it multiple times if you're using offline installer. So I'm going to search for off offline installer and let's search for it. Now, the first link which I'm getting, I'm going to open this in new tab and let's see this. And now, in this link, what I'm going to do now is as Microsoft is recently released Visual Studio 2015 community 2015 edition, so it's showing as the first result. So I'm going to scroll down a little bit. So I will be putting this link in uh, YouTube description. So so you can copy and click on that. So I'm going to scroll down a little bit. And there you can see there is Visual Studio 2013. Click on that. And then select ISO option here and click on download. So once you click on download, your ISO file image download will be started. And once that is done, you need a software to unzip this ISO file. So the best software which can be used for, for extracting ISO image files is you can go for a software called 7-zip and, and I'm going to show you how to download and install it. I just searched for 7-zip and this is the website address where you can actually see 7-zip.org and click on this and and my system is 64-bit. I'm going to download this and in your system you might have to, depending on your system, you might have to go for the software which you need. Okay, so I installed 7-zip in my software, in my system. Now what I'm going to do is I am going to go for the folder which I downloaded. So this is the file which I downloaded, Visual Studio 2013 Community Edition. And now I'm going to right click on this 7-zip and I'm going to extract this to here the same place and it will start the process like this and it will take a minute so it is extracting a IS4 image into the respective path so it might take you around uh, two minutes for extraction it is about to complete the extraction process and once the extraction is done by 7-zip uh, software, you can see that it's showing at the top 96% of extraction is done. And once it is done, I'm going to open that folder and install Visual Studio Community Edition. Okay, so let's see this. Extraction is done. Okay, now I can see that the folder is here, so I'm going to double click on this. And all I need to do is right click on this and run as administrator and that will complete the installation of Visual Studio 2013 Community Edition. So all you need to do is run as administrator and click on next, next, next. So I already have installed Visual Studio Community Edition in my system so I'm not doing it. So all you guys need to do is run as administrator and click on next, next and complete the process of installation. So just to summarize, I first searched for Visual Studio 2013 Community Edition offline installer and I installed 7-zip software which is used for extraction and I extracted the IS4 file and I opened the folder and vscommunity.exe right click on this and run as administrator you're all done. In case if you face any issues please add those in the comments I'll try to respond to them. Thank you.